Well, it wouldn't be the start of spring training if we didn't have some injury updates for the Yankees. The same day that pitchers and catchers report, we have news on Frankie Montas and that he is going to have shoulder surgery and is probably going to miss the rest of the season. Aaron Boone said that the best case for Frankie Montas is that he could return late in the season. But let's be honest, even if he is able to return late in the season, he won't be ready to pitch for the Yankees. He won't be back to his old self by then. So in my mind, Frankie Montas's tenure with the Yankees is pretty much up. And boy, it has not been a good one. He pitched... 39 and two-thirds innings for the Yankees last year and had a 6.35 ERA and a negative 0.6 war. The worst part about this is that the Yankees gave up a lot of prospects to get this guy at the trade deadline last year. The biggest prospect they gave up is Ken Waldachuk, who is now ranked on MLB Pipeline's top 100 prospects as the 76th best prospect in baseball. And he's a starting pitcher. This trade just not looking good for the Yankees. They gave up Ken Waldachuk, who's a top 100 prospect. They also gave up many other good prospects who are borderline top 100. So, this is not a good trade for the Yankees. Yes, you have Lou Trevino on the squad because of that trade. But Frankie Montas... What a disaster of a trade. And it was hard to predict that, it, you know, he would be out for this entire season. But it does show that the Carlos Rodon signing, it was a needed one. Because the Yankees rotation is now pretty slim. You have Garrett Cole and Carlos Rodon, two great pitchers there to start the rotation. Then you have Nestor Cortez who we know just had a hamstring injury, Luis Severino, who pitched around 100 innings last year, and then you have Domingo Herman and Clark Schmidt kind of battling out for the 4th and 5th spots. Just not that good. Because one or two injuries to that rotation, and it's just crumbling out from the bottom. I mean, Cole and Rodon are two great pitchers, But Rodon also has injury issues. So there's really, in my mind, only one good pitcher in the Yankees rotation who we can be confident will throw near 200 innings, and that's Garrett Cole. So the the rotation's in a tough spot here. I'll be interested to see if the Yankees try to beef up the rotation before the season starts via trade or maybe potentially signing a free agent. We'll have to see if the Yankees decide to do that. But that's the news. Frankie Montas is likely out for the rest of the season. Hope this is a good first day of spring training for you.